Just when you thought airplane cabins couldn't get any more packed, think again. Patent sketches from the Airbus shows there's some new and unusual ways that they are thinking about cramming even more people into the airplane. So joining us now for more details is travel expert Mark uh, Murphy. L we have to look at these sketches first. You have to right. tell us, like, I saw them and I, I thought, oh, this must be like a cartoon. This can't be real. No, it's great. You know, <laughs> stack people up. But think about it. The 747 put that second deck on and yeah. they put people in business class and first class up there yeah. and but you were separated by a floor now you may be separated by the rear end yeah so oh boy, but look at that yeah so but keep in mind you might have little stairs going up there's different designs these airline manufacturers do hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of patents a year 99.9 .9 percent of them never happen uh -huh. but what they want to do is protect that idea. So mm. if they do go forward with it, anybody else that wants to put that on their own aircraft, uh, uh, a la Boeing, they're gonna pay Airbus to configure their seats that way. Remember a few years ago, we had the bicycle seats. Oh yeah, right. I don't know if you remember that. Yeah. We had the strap hanger yeah. uh, concept. No. So no, literally like a subway, a subway in the sky. No thanks. Oh wow. That didn't go anywhere. But for this particular patent, what are they saying is the benefit here for passengers? Well, let's not worry about the passengers. Let's just, <laughs> let's just worry about putting oh, more people me. on the plane. What are you thinking about? Sorry. So yeah, the idea is to be able to fit more people, and they say create more space because you you do have these wide body planes. You have this A380, the double decker. So now what you they're thinking about is how can they put more people on? And then we think about the green movement and everything else. If you have more people, you know, less emissions per people per person. You, there, there's a lot of benefits. To, and we're going to have a boom in travel for the next several decades. We're going to need more planes to move more people and to do it more efficiently. And I think this is one idea. We'll see where it goes. I can see you having to reach down to get your peanuts, you know? Yeah, um, right. If so, you fall over, you break your neck. Yeah, right? really. So realistically, do you think we'll see this? I mean, you said that they make these patents all the time. I think, yeah, it's very rare that this exact configuration will happen. But could a variant of this happen? Yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I don't say no. I think it could conceivably happen. I'm still trying to figure out where the heck the luggage is going. Oh, gosh. Good point. You could bounce it on your head, you know, work oh, on your posture. No idea. Don't give me yeah, any no ideas. Yeah, no, thank you.